Good evening, everybody. Um, how are we? So I am a bit washed out and pale tonight. I'm uh, a bit under the weather with this um, buggy chest infection thing. Um, some of you may know that um, I won a competition from <coughs> I'm sorry, Night Gear on um, Facebook the other night to win uh, a load of web text equipment and, and goodies and the parcel arrived today so this is just a quick unboxing to see what was in the box and uh, and a big shout out and thank you to Night Gear. Okay here we go the box just put it to one side um, gas masks Okay, so um, balaclava style um, head dip, headpiece. Uh, I'm presuming this is the similar to the the fire retardant uh, Omex uh, under gas mask type of um, protection that you get. Next up. Extending Alley Shelter Pole. Okay. For those that um, hitchhike or survivalists, or or even if you've got kids that like building um, little dens and whatnot, simply unscrew, adjust to the height, tighten. And you have a pole, usually suitable for with uh, use with something like the old army style ponchos. You just tie off the hood, pop that through, tie off the four corners, or using a bit of bungee cord to the uh, nearest tree, and bingo, you have shelter for you know whatever you need shelter. Next up, ooh, ah, it's the new um, 3D real tree style ghillie suit. Oh, that's awesome! I have wanted a ghillie suit for a long, long time. Look, look at that fine mesh. I don't know if you can see that very well. Fine mesh with this uh, real tree camouflage printed leaves all over it. And that's the top. That should be yeah, good to have fun with. <coughs> Trousers as well. Cranky. Complete ghillie like suit. Uh, I'm not sure how these compare to the old uh, old school burlap and super glue, but I mean, just look at that. That is lightweight, and by printing the the real tree camouflage on, and then adding the leaves, you get a real 3D style effect. I look forward to giving that a go somewhere. Not sure where, but I'll give it a go. Next up, we have put that back there. Steel of Fire Survival Knife. Okay, so it's a locking blade, serrated edge, with one hand opening operation. Nylon handle with built in emergency whistle, removable LED torch, and six mil steel of fire built into the tool. Okay, so this is basically a uh, uh, smaller and more pocket friendly version of the old Rambo survival knives. Now, I'm sure most of you have seen them, they're about that long and 
little compass at the top. You won't screw it. You get a bit of fishing wire and well, basically, this is the pocket friendly version. You got your your torch, your flint, your blade, and so on. So yeah, multi use, multi purpose. I may just wrap a bit of power cord on that in a similar fashion I did to my watch strap just for the sake of being able to um, night gear catalogue going to enjoy looking through that because I am after some bits and pieces where warrior waterproof notebook now I'm going to find that because I volunteer with the, uh, the army cadets occasionally this will come uh, in handy uh, especially out in the field and tactical goodness um, it's even got weights and measurements on the back grey paper writes underwater tear proof grid lined paper so tear proof let's see whoops I tore it Oh uh, dear. I don't know whether that's tear proof or tear proof, but it certainly ripped quite easily. Um, uh, Warrior helmet band. Those are familiar with them. Just wrap it around your, your helmet cover. Just gives a bit of um, tidy finish and protection to the to the edge of your helmet. Um, got two squeezy stress toy grenades. Might use one of those as a stocking filler. That's fun. And finally, a Ah, uh, 511 tactical, presumably challenge coin. For um, those that aren't aware, challenge coin is uh, <coughs> a bit of a US military thing, but I think uh, it started to be adopted over the here slightly. Uh, you go to your bar, uh, your naffy, your mess, what have you. You place your challenge coin on the table. Last person put their challenge coin on the table buys a round of drinks or the person without the challenge coin buys a round of drinks uh, you can go into a bit more depth and go by order of superiority of the, the regiment or the branch of service but I won't go into that too much but anyway those are the goodies I want from Night Gear so thank you very much to everyone at Night Gear for picking me and I'm going to have some fun trying these things out um, and happy Christmas and a happy new year to you all. Thank you. Ciao.